education! Oh, sorry, I get a bit excited when I'm learning and te- I mean teaching. Yeah, I'm teaching you guys stuff. All right, guys, let's go. Hydrogen. He's the lightest and most abundant element on the periodic table. This guy is very chill. He's the life of the party. But you know what? You give this guy a fireball, he's he's burning. He's full on having a meltdown. Helium. Helium is like the little brother of hydrogen that doesn't have anger issues. Also, he's slightly autistic. Lithium. Very soft metal. But try to be careful when you're around him because if you hurt his feelings or splash water on him, he'll probably start sizzling a bit and go cry in a corner. Beryllium. Beryliosis. Boron. Boron is good to clean clothes. Carbon. Thanks for existing as the building block of life, so I had to pay taxes. Selfish pr Next on the list, we got nine. Nitrogen. Now, little people know this, but there's more nitrogen in the air than oxygen. Oxygen. Good to breathe. Good to drink. Fluorine. Good for teeth. Bad for everything else. Neon. Bad for breathe. Good to see. Why the? F why did I write this? this? This is an awful script. Sodium. Stupid high blood pressure. Magnesium. Mag magnesium. I. I. Magnesium. Light a fire. Or don't. I'm not the boss. Aluminum. I it's aluminum. I don't know what you expected because this is so fuck. Silicon. It's used for making chips. Phosphorus. <laughs> Sulfur. In the recording, I, I sound like I'm at gunpoint. Guys, please forgive me. <laughs> I'm not at gunpoint that you know of. Chlorine. Mixing ammonium and bleach does not make mustard gas. Gives you chloramine. I mean, you still shouldn't do it, but argon. It's used to make light bulbs. Potassium. You, you know what potassium is used for? That's right. Explosives. Looks like I guess you need it for your body, but you know, that's neither here nor there. Calcium. Ooh, Mr. Bones. Scandium. Alloyed bikes. Titanium. Not alloyed bikes. Vanadium. Some sometimes alloyed bikes. Chromium. Hey, your grandpa knows that one. Hey, your mom knows that one. Iron. It's iron. What? What else do you think it is? Cobalt. Goblins. Nickel. Two loonies and a tune to get you half a pound of this stuff. Copper. You existing gives me pain. Whenever I do the electron configuration, guys, it sounds nerdy, but trust me, keep on track. This is a little secret for zinc. Don't melt your pennies down and sell the zinc for profit, guys. Guys, guys, don't do that. I'm telling you guys not to. Gallium. Gallium is the safer version of mercury. Does anyone else remember the gallium challenge? Like, I swear, I bring it up to anybody and they say they've never heard the gallium challenge. Germanium. Diodes. Arsenic. Poison. Selenium. This one makes you smell bad. Oh, it's in nuts. So, bromine. Flame retard. What'd you call me? Krypton. No, not the planet. It's still pretty dope as hell. Rubidium. Unlike lithium, his meltdowns would probably cost you a finger. Haha, <laughs> I'm just kidding. You guys probably wouldn't survive. Strontium. Fireworks. Yttrium. Yags. Yes, yags. Yttrium aluminum garnet. Okay. Zirconium. Cool name. Oh yeah, I guess he can kind of absorb electrons and escape the hellish pits of a nuclear reactor. Niobium. I'm gonna say it. This one's crystals are prettier than business. You stupid pick me bit. You wanna buy a crystal for your girlfriend? Or... <laughs> Who am I kidding? Do you really have a girlfriend? I would recommend niobium instead of bismuth. Higher melting point, prettier colors. I mean, look at this. Molybdenum. That's the natural element name. Important in steel manufacturing. Technetium. Now, this is the first radioactive element that we see. Other than the isotopes, you pretentious nerds. All right, don't correct me. So it's pretty useful in bone marrow and liver imaging. Ruthenium. Jewelry. Rhodium. Jewelry. Also Cadillac converters. Palladium. Jewelry. Also ceramic capacitors. Silver. Please, it's silver. You already know this one, all right? Cadmium. This one's basically diet lead. Indium. Indium is a very soft metal. So soft that you can chew it, and I've done it before. Tin. No. Tin foil isn't made of tin. Tin cans are also not made from tin. But you know what is made from tin? That's right. The Big Buddha. Antimony. Very pretty color solutions. Very not so pretty health conditions. Tellurium. Okay, this one's used in optic fibers, but also touching this pure metal will make you smell. Iodine. This one's both good and bad for you. Xenon. Car lights. Cesium. Atomic clocks. Barium. Fuck you. All right, so now we've reached this awkward bit of the periodic table, so, you know, let's get ready for the Lanthanite speed, speed run. run. Lanthanum. Lighters. Cerium. Also lighters. Praseodymium. Alloys. Neodymium. Magnets. Promethium. Useless paint pigments and batteries. Samarium. Magnets. Two, apparently. Europium. Fluorescence. Gat Millennium. Super, Super magnets. magnets. Useless alloys. Useless alloys. Useless alloys. Useless alloys. Useless alloys. Alloys. Useless. All right, now that's the end of the speed run. Let's get back to it. Hafnium. Badass plasma cutters. Tantalum. White filaments. Tungsten. Yeah. He's got a hell of a high melting point. He's good at making alloys, but you know what the downside is? He's brittle. Whoops. Rhenium. Super cool jet metal. Oh my god. Osmium. This is the densest element in the periodic table. Iridium. I don't know why people argue that this is the densest element. Yeah, there's a whole argument. I don't know why. But those who do argue that this is the densest element are just mentally confused. Platinum. Lab equipment. Gold. Jewelry. Alloys. Computers. Teeth. Bro, this one does the whole group project. Mercury. You know what? He used to be useful. Thermometers. And thermostats. Thallium. So I got this stuff. I keep it in mineral oil. In a sealed ampule. In a sealed bag. In a sealed container. And you know what? I'm still afraid to hold it. You know why? Cause it's absolutely terrifying to hold. It's super poisonous. Lead, 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 lead. Bismuth is the crystal girl that pretends to be ill for attention but isn't. Similar to how bismuth is slightly radioactive, but not enough to harm you. Fuck you, bismuth. People only know you for the crystals and nothing else. You are the reason I have issues with Google correcting me and showing me some random character from Steven Universe. Who is that? Who is that? Oh yeah, also bismuth is the last of the stable ones, so uh, stuff is about to get crazy from here. Polonium. Got a tux with too much static? Why not use enough radiation to kill your entire family to fix the issue? 
That'll do the trick. Astatine. At any given moment, there's less than 24 grams of this stuff on Earth. It's almost as rare as the peace and quiet in my neighborhood when my neighbors start snorting grams of cocaine. Radon. Want lung cancer? No? Too bad. Francium. Lasts longer than my combined mental stability in an entire day. At 22 minutes. Radium. Hey, you want some positive energy in your water? How about some radium? Wanna tell the time? How about some radium? Wanna get down funky? Oh yeah, yeah, it's radium. Radium will do the trick. Whoops, the positive energy is giving everyone a case of decaying alive. Actinium. Good for shooting neutrons. Thorium. Used in TIG welding. Microwaves and in glass. Protactinium. Useless. And I I'm not, I'm not saying this to be mean. This element is genuinely useless. It's extremely toxic, very radioactive, and Protactinium's name literally comes from the names Proto Actinium. His name isn't even original. It comes from actinium. Uranium. Reactors. Glass. Intercontinental ballistic missiles. Dentures. Neptunium. He's also used in firing neutrons, so I guess he gets a pass. Plutonium. Nuclear batteries. Americium. Smoke detectors. Curium. Rovers and other spacecraft. Also, at this point forward, owning any of these elements is illegal. Berkelium. 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 This one's used in creating super heavy atoms on the periodic table. I've always wanted an element called meitnerium. Californium. Want to know how moist your oil, soil, or foil is? You do? Cool! Einsteinium. This one glows blue, just from extreme radiation, and I find that super hilarious. Fermium. Used in alloys to figure out the enthalpy of vaporization of itself. He's trying his best. Give him some credit. Unlike some other elements. Mendelevium. Daddy periodic table. Uh, welcome to a, a very short speed run. Useless. 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 Why do they keep making these elements? Also useless. Anyway, and a speed run. Meetnarium. Hey, this one's named after a woman. Darmstantium. Uh, this one lasts less than a second. Runt genium. I don't know how to pronounce this one. This one actually lasts for 10 minutes. Wow. Copernicium. Oh, this one lasts less than a minute. So, of course. Nihonium. For all you weaves out there, I found your favorite element named after Japan. So yeah, you go go awe at it or something. Flerovium. Muscovium. Should these even count as elements? If at any given moment, they don't exist. Livamorium. Tennessee. No, I don't like country music. Alganesson. Uh, this one's a solid in the row of noble gases. Honorable mentions. Unanenium and Unbanilium. They're still trying to make more elements. We have a big enough table!